Hey guys, it's me, Mr. 250, and welcome back to Minecraft. So I've just been digging down this hole, if you saw from our first episode um, of Season 2. That's what I'm going to be calling it, Season 2. Um, dug up a little bit, I got a little bit of iron ore, and I'll show you um, a little more about that in a second. But I wanted to, before I went on any farther, I wanted to... Uh, bring you guys with me because I found something interesting um first off uh, I can I can start off by saying one of the new things about the update is bats at a certain level that I do not currently have on my head or in front of me um, bats will spawn and they make little squeaky sounds which are uh, arguably cute not saying they are, just saying they might be. And if you listen carefully. Yep, there was one. Um, they make their little little squeaky sounds and whatnot. Um, which I I guess now is might be a, a good way of finding caves. Because a lot of times caves, you could find them by... Uh, if you heard those mysterious sounds, like the cave sounds, that was one of the better ways of finding them. But, uh, I'd have to say, <laughs> at deep elevations, um, those little guys make a lot of noise. So, at deep elevations, you could probably use them to find caves a lot easier. Because they make a lot of noise and they're fairly high-pitched. <laughs> squeak, squeak! Uh, but that's all I wanted to say about that, and I thought, for our first caving expedition in this world, um... We'd take a trip together. I don't have a lot of supplies. Um, I always like to bring a lot of wood with me when I go caving, but um, we're not too far away from the entrance, and I'm not going to go too terribly far since I don't have any armor or anything. Um, this is all I see of right now, though. So let's get down there. See if we can find that bat too. I haven't actually seen any that haven't been in video. Oh, there you are! Come back, come back! Oh, you look so cool! Look at you! Whoa! Oh, oh, hello! Okay. Get out of here! Ah! Um, I'm a little iffy about the new sounds, like hear that skeleton sound a little iffy about them I'm not sure if I like them or if I don't they are they sound more bony and skeletony now which may or may not be a good thing uh, I'm not sure yet we'll find out I guess um also another thing uh, since last video I listened to my video it has a lot of background noise in it, and it picks up my keyboard really easily, which is kind of bad. So I've bumped down the volume that it receives, and I've gotten a little closer to the microphone. So hopefully it'll be picking up more of me and less of what's around me. Because I, I don't want you hearing clickety-clack-clack-clack-clack-clack the whole time. That, that might get a little bit annoying. Oh! Thank you, zombie. <laughs> um, so, I guess we can talk short-term and long-term goals. Um, long-term goal is obviously build a gigantic glass um, palace under the water. Um, that's obviously very long-term. Thinking, uh, thinking way ahead, way, way ahead. Um, but for short-term, ooh, ooh. I see wood, that means, uh, abandoned mine shaft, which is good. Sorry, I lost in the battle sound. Okay. Um, oh, there's a slime over there. We'll need that for our lovely sticky pistons that we'll need. <sighs> Come here. Give me a little guy. Oh boy. 
Wow, we already found one of these. This is really good. I, I, I couldn't have hoped for this good for our first dig. Wow. Okay, uh... Hello there, zombie. Well, I didn't even think about it, um... Because of this update, sometimes monsters will spawn with armor on them. That could be an interesting challenge. Definitely something I'm not used to. Okay, <laughs> I agree with the YouTuber, those bats are kind of annoying. Need to get some armor so I don't get these fancy business clothes dirty. Not sure how to make this too interesting. Uh, I already talked about me leaving Avorn. Um, I already talked about the new project that I would be doing. Those were both last episode. We found those amazing mushroom biomes which are supplying us with our delicious food that I just so happen not to bring any with me so I'm actually gonna save this till I get down to four. How many food does mushroom soup do? Is it four or three? I'm gonna wait till I get down to four and find out. Oh yeah, and we can make pumpkin pie. Oh man, I forgot how excited I was for this update. It's been so long. Oh, we got some gold. Oh, that's a bat. That's a bat in rest. I haven't seen one like that yet. Do you see him? adorable. Look at him. Boo! Um, yeah. If we could get a lot of iron, that would be excellent. I've already got a few pieces at home. This is actually enough, I think, or at least almost enough for a full armor suit. And if we just find a few more we can get tools, that would be that would be an amazing start off. Keep me from dying. We've got plenty of coal, so no worrying about running out of torches or fuel. Um the biggest thing I'm actually worried about is I can't make another pick right now. And I can't mine that yet either. Oh, more bats? Yeah, they're everywhere. I thought these things would be kind of rare. <laughs> At least a little bit, but I guess not. Hmm. Oh, and what I'm doing right now, normally when I go through caving, I do like completionist caving. Like, I won't leave a section until I've mined everything out of it. Um... That's very boring caving to watch. Okay, it's three. Um, that's very boring caving to watch, though, so... I'm not doing that with you guys. I'm just mining a few things. Mostly the iron, because um, I don't want to miss it. And I'll come back in for the coal later. Off camera, of course. Um, we can do a little exploring together, though, can't we? Oh, is this a ravine? I, I can't see. I'm getting pushed. Dang water. No, that made it worse. Okay, and let's block you off too. There we go. Okay, uh, yeah, it looks like we got a bit of a ravine that I think leads up to the ocean. Wow. Let me grab this little bit of iron. I want to swim out up to the ocean if I can. We got lots of abandoned mine shafts, so we'll probably be finding melons before too long. Oh, we got a chest. Uh, not going to let this moment pass me up. Let me grab that real quick. What do we got in here? 
Good stuff. Ooh. Melon seeds, some food, which I think that bread looks different. Did they retexture that? Might have been one of those tiny change log things that I never bothered to check. Okay. Um, unless I see any more chest, we'll get out of here. Nope, I don't see any. Oh, grab a breath of air. And up we go. Hopefully not drowning in the process. Oh, and it's raining. Isn't that lovely? Ah, okay, there's our island. There's our mushroom island. And right in between is some nicely lit up holes in the ground that we can go to re to resume our caving. Well, that was nice, wasn't it? Um, okay, so I think I know a couple things I need to do. Um, first off, that area is crawling with mushrooms. So what we're probably going to do is we're going to make some shears soon. And I think you can shear off their mushrooms and make them into regular cows, which would be really cool. So I think I'll do that soon um, off camera. I just wanted to take you for our caving trip together. I thought that'd be fun. And I'll I'll do some more caving. This is not all the materials that we'll need, but it is a, a decent start. And it's gotten us some delicious items. So, anyway... Um, I know, I know, I'm looking at the clock right now, this one is a bit shorter. Uh, but I didn't really have too much planned, I just wanted to take you for the caving trip. But I didn't want to go too far. Uh, considering I didn't have any armor or anything on. Actually, we can make some here. Make a delicious chest plate, some delicious shoes. Uh, we can make a hat in a second. This is going to be great. <laughs> and we'll go back and explore that, and then we'll probably go off, you know, by boat. I'm not swimming anymore, if I can help it. We'll go by boat and see if we can find a nice little flat-bottomed area of the ocean that's fairly deep. And I think that'll work out. Um, yeah, so thank you for watching. And I'll see you next time. Bye.